This week, of course, we're talking about uh, your campaign against uh, breaking the silence against that organization. First of all, what can you tell us about the responses to your campaign? Well, as we see, uh, our campaign uh, had uh, a major success. We are very, very proud of uh, the Israeli society that is very supportive. A uh, lot of people understand here and in, in the Jewish community in the world that we are suffering from a very serious problem. The problem is uh, foreign governments who um, uh, fund in foreign money uh, NGOs in Israel, and, and those are foreign agents. Israel is the only open society in the history that uh, have uh, such a big challenges. We don't. We are not have uh, uh, challenges like Brit like Britain, but much much better. And we have to save our democ democracy. And this is the fight on democracy, not nothing else. Now, what do you say to those who say it was a bit too much? You exaggerated when you decided to attack uh, specific people and define them as uh, foreign agents. Well. When we see someone like Avner Gvaryahu or someone like Hagai Elad for the CEO of Bezalem, those are matured people. If they went to uh, uh, international media and told us uh, and told the people all over the world that we are uh, war, cr war uh, criminals and that Israel is making a, a, a ethnic a cleansing to Bedouins in the Negev, those are lies. Those are vicious lies. And if they took responsibility to tell it to all over the world, we can also uh, come and uh, criticize them on what they are doing. Now today uh, your conference is uh, talking about human rights. Well, this is the third year that Im Tirzu uh, is doing the, uh, co the Zionist Conference for Human Rights. And we are doing it because in the end of the day, Zionism brought to the world the only mechanism who has human rights in a, in a terrible place like the Middle East. We have, uh, again, an open society, not a violent society, and, and this is the only the only stable place in the world. Look what's happening in Iran, in Saudi, in Egypt, in Lebanon. Why uh, all the world condemn Israel? Why all those foreign agents with foreign money try to change us from within? The Zionist country is the only country that that's, that is strong and stable in the Middle East. Look what is going on around us. So we want this foreign money, this foreign involvement to stop. This is colonialism. We call those governments to stop, uh, uh, ruin our life and ruin our society.